hello everyone so today in this video i actually wanted to talk about uh, uh, a problem which i faced today in fact it was since yesterday i was facing this problem and i think i think i solved it by doing some uh, online research so if you are using and of course I'll, I'll i'll tell you what i use i use arch linux i use dwm and i'm using brave so what happened yesterday i was not really able to upload anything from brave browser so i made a video and i wanted to of course upload it but i was not able to upload it because uh, usually when you're using browser or when you're doing something like a file upload from browser you have the option to uh, uh, click on a button or somewhere to basically open up uh, this uh, this uh, dialogue where you can actually upload files and it was not working for me it was uh, really annoying and uh, uh, Although there are workarounds, you can always uh, try drag and drop. But if you're using DWM, there is no drag and drop because there is no file manager. I mean, of course, apart from your terminal, you can of course install you know uh, some some file managers with like GUI based file managers and do drag and drop. But drag and drop is not always available. And I really wanted to fix this problem. So what I did, I did some uh, you know research online, of course. I first try to figure out whether it's a brave problem, you know, brave browser problem, or whether it is a problem with uh, my, my my setup. And and by the way, I did an upgrade of uh, Arch, I think uh, yesterday. So maybe it was due to that. I also upgraded my Brave, so I was not hundred percent sure why this is happening. So I did some you know research online, and uh, basically I looked at so basically so in case you don't know this dialog box, it comes from this uh, XDG desktop portal uh, and uh, <clears throat> I, I, I was actually trying to uh, you know look at uh, various uh, various uh, forums online forums and what I found is that if you search for something like this you know like system CTL user service you will actually find uh, something here like for me it was the uh, XTG desktop portal GTK which was uh, shown as uh, failed and uh, I did, of course, you know, another search online. I tried to. It, it was not. It was a bit difficult for me, so I had to basically. Uh, I mean, I mean, when I read those forums, they were saying that uh, get rid of uh, this uh, this package called XTG Desktop Portal Gnome Genome. But I, this package was not even installed on my computer, and finally, I tried to basically dis like remove this GTK. So XTG desktop portal GTK, I, I removed it completely and it worked. It worked for me. And I thought I'll probably share it with you in case you have a similar setup like, like mine. And uh, you can of course, you know, look at your like journal CTL, your, your, your system D log. And uh, it was also showing uh, error somewhere. Of course, right now there is no error. I mean, there are some problems, but uh, not related to XTG. And uh, this is how I, of course, you know, I was able to solve it. I just removed the package completely, GTK, you know, the the uh, XTG desktop portal hyphen GTK. Uh, that service was was failing and I removed it when it worked. And that is it. I just wanted to share and, of course, I'm going to make this short video because you might face something similar and you might not find an answer online. And I thought, okay, let me just try to help. All right, that is it. That is all I wanted to talk about and uh, share in this video. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.